Remind Me is an email reminder service that can come in very handy. You can remember important dates by emailing reminders to yourself. The URL for Remind Me is below. However, it's not a clickable link. The link is above this video. You can go to Remind Me anytime by clicking on the link above the video. In fact, let's go there now. Okay, Remind Me wants you to log in. So I can do that now. Hmm, and it looks as if I'm new here. Remind Me just wants you to register by putting in your password a couple of more times and you're all signed up. Confirmation required. Remind Me is an opt-in service. That means they need a confirmation email from you to make sure you signed up and it wasn't somebody just fooling around with your email. So now you have to check your email for something from Remind Me. Everyone's email client looks a little different. I happen to be using Gmail in this case. Ordinarily, the email will come anywhere from right away to a couple of minutes. If there's any problem at all, if it doesn't show up in a while, the problem was probably a little typo in your email, which is very easy to do. Just go back and sign up again. Remind me isn't particular. Let's see if the email has come yet. The email is here. Okay, it's from Last Minute Gifts, and the title is Confirm Opt-in. Now, this email is just basically making sure that you asked for this service and by clicking on this you agree yes you want the service you're looking for a long link uh, ordinarily just clicking on it will take you right back to remind me if there is any problem just copy the whole link and paste it into your browser but 99 percent of the time all you have to do is click on the link and you go right back to remind me there is a welcome message this time uh, and all you have to do is log in again. Once you log in, you'll see a big long welcome message just confirming that your account has been set up and it is operating. Now let's add a reminder. To add a reminder, you've got a number of choices. Uh, when to send the reminder, the earliest you can send it, or the latest you can send it, is one day before the date. You can also send it various other times. Okay, how many times do you want to be reminded about this date? Once only? That's pretty good. Um, birthdays and things? Annually. Uh, now there is a problem with this if you pick anything other than once only. It won't turn itself off. You will have to manually turn off the mail once the date has been reached. You can read more about it here. I'll let you do that. And the last question is the date that you want to remember. Now, if this is November the 7th, the earliest date I can remind myself of is November the 8th. And I can put the reminder message for myself here. Um, take out the trash. I know it sounds trivial, but I'm always forgetting. So let's add this reminder. The reminder is successfully added. And it will show up tomorrow, letting me know tomorrow is trash day. Meanwhile, Back in your email, you'll see another reply from Last Minute Gifts, which sponsors Remind Me. It basically lets you know what the reminder is and when it's coming. Every time you make a reminder, 
you'll get a confirmation letter like this from Remind Me. This is a courtesy and can really come in handy when you use it once in a while. However, if you do one of those all-at-once sessions and load everybody's birthdays and anniversaries in there at one sitting, you're going to get a lot of generated email. It isn't spam, it's just confirming all those reminders and you can simply delete the emails if there's nothing to check. And that's it for now about Remind Me. To give Remind Me a try, you can use this URL here, you can copy it into your browser, or easier yet, use the clickable link that's above this video. Thanks for watching and enjoy!